Hi guys, my name is Daniela Mani and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna talk to y'all while I eat because I'm very hungry. And I hope the sound quality is good because I do have a plastic bag like right here. And also like I'm in like a break room type situation. This is like one of my favorite places to come eat in between my classes. Um, why am I talking? Like I literally anyway, sorry about that. Sorry, like I'm getting sidetracked so quickly. Today's September 6th. It's been a week, y'all. It's been a week. So today was like this week marked the completion of like the third week of classes. This week did a number on me, I'm not gonna lie. If y'all are new here, I go to Georgia Tech. I'm a neuroscience major. Not taking any neuroscience classes right now, but I am taking 16 credits. I have a bio lab, a chem lab. I have psych, calculus, and English. And so like my load is like relatively hefty. Then on top of that, I decided to start a job. So I've been working quite a few hours um, each week and I'm still trying to like maintain my my sanity my peace so like this week has literally been a lot i wanted to vlog earlier in the week and that never happened so i'm just gonna make this a weekend in my life vlog i'm very excited about this vlog because i'm excited about fall time and i always love like fall vlogs and gearing up for the fall and if y'all can't see i got on a hoodie today it's about to be like cold colder very much sweater weather you know i'm very excited about that i'm gonna make this video like a little weekend in my life but i wanted to start it now so y'all get a little bit of school content and then also get like outside of school content you know i think it's about one o'clock i have a class at two my calculus class i had two classes this morning and then i went to tutoring for my math class because when i tell y'all whatever happened in lecture wednesday I don't know like at some point i just zoned out because i i find it very hard to follow my uh calc professor so every week i just end up going to some extra help session and they literally just explain to me like what happened in lecture so my studio is today at 3 p.m in this building i mean not 3 p.m 2 p.m i'm sorry and i get out at 2 50 and then i have work at 4. my week's pretty much been like looking like that like class in the morning work in the evening so i've been trying to like do homework in between classes and stuff like that which has been going pretty well but regardless it's still like a tiring schedule or whatever part of the reason that like this week was a lot is because like like i said i'm like doing school like doing all my classes going to work and i'm also trying to like maintain parts of like me so i feel like myself still like you know so like i've been going to bible studies on thursday mornings which i've really really enjoyed it's helping me stay in touch and like rooted with god even while like taking all my classes and stuff and so i don't know if you guys heard and this is a little slightly touchy topic but i don't know if you guys heard about the um school shooting that happened on wednesday of this week that was slightly near not slightly near that was very near to where i went to high school and i don't know just like it got me thinking and i like i actually was very emotional about the topic i was literally just like breaking down i don't know like it was i think it hit so much closer to home and there's an article that said that there's been 45 school shooting since january which is insane because i have only heard about this one or i might have heard about another one but like it didn't ring as deeply as this one did because i think like how the media is now like everything's super desensitized and so i feel like i myself has have gotten desensitized to the idea of like that happening and stuff like that and so like this being so close to home like really like shook me up like it definitely shook me up i'll share a couple pointers from the bible study because i think it like really went with how i was feeling so the bible study was talking about love on thursday um and we read matthew 17 verses i think 22 to matthew 18 27 if i'm not mistaken i might be i'm sorry to me it really set out like you know you just need to love the people around you and like like it was really showing me like okay people can go in an instant like you never know what might happen in a day you never know if you might lose a loved one like that sort of situation you just you never know like you really never know like those people went to school that morning and like they didn't know that they were gonna lose their lives you know and so i think like that was just something that was really important to me and like as i was thinking about it i was like you know sometimes it gets hard to love people especially like let's say if you see somebody like all the time and you guys have issues you guys get into arguments that are like you might not be showing them the kind of love that you need to be showing them the verse that we read like it jesus is saying to just like be as a child humble yourself as if you're a child you know and just learn that you just need to do like you just need to love you know like you need to love 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 basically like there's a verse that says love covers a multitude of sins and i just like like that was very touching to me on yesterday and so i just wanted to share that
I'm in the room. I'm already in room four. I'm only working four hours this evening. I got off at eight today. Okay, y'all. I'm about to head out, but I will talk to y'all after my shift. Obviously, I can't record at work or nothing like that, but I'll try to talk to y'all when I'm on the way back to the dorm. good morning you guys it's not morning it's like 1 30 almost this morning i woke up you know put my laundry in the wash and then like i cut my nails did my eyebrows some of the self-care stuff that i don't get to do during the week put my laundry in the dryer and then i went back upstairs and i went to bed like i wasn't asleep i was awake the whole time but like my period started this morning and cramps have been going crazy and i'm just like tired very tired i need to get some groceries because like i ran out of some of my laundry stuff and then i also need like more pads and i also have a good amount of work to do not any like assignments any or anything that's due but like it's nearing the time when i'm about to start having all my exams so i wanted to start doing like preparations and studying and i also want to get ahead of my work for next week just to make it easier on myself like with my my working schedule um i'm very hungry i legit have not ate kind of want chick-fil-a Okay, yo. sorry about this angle i got chick-fil-a which took me forever just because like the drive i went to the chick-fil-a on campus so like the drive from walmart which should be like eight minutes away but for whatever reason there's a lot of traffic um to here like took me forever um so it's literally 3 30 right now and i think my boyfriend is on his way up here i still have not started any school work i really am not in the mood which is so insane because i know I, I have stuff that i need to do i'm about to tear up this chick-fil-a and i'm gonna watch some youtube and stuff and then go to my room i don't know when i'm gonna talk to y'all again but i'll talk to y'all at some point okay y'all it's like 11 something i've been sitting at my desk doing work for like four or five hours so i didn't make it to the gym today but i do still feel like kind of proud of myself because i was very productive and i got a lot of work done so i feel ahead of the game for next week i'm gonna take a shower and then i'm gonna spend the rest of my night editing sorry i'm looking for roaches my building has roaches <laughs> but yeah i'm gonna take a shower spend the rest of my night editing and i'm gonna set an alarm so i can wake up early for church tomorrow and i will see y'all then good morning guys happy sunday i'm leaving for church i thought i was gonna want to get breakfast but i'm not hungry but like the last time i ate was like yesterday at 3 p.m so i feel like i might be hungry in the middle of service but it's okay i'm wearing this h&m dress that i feel like i wear literally all the time but the dress that i wanted to wear i couldn't get a zip up myself and my roommate was sleeping and i was not about to walk on these atlanta streets with my back out um i go pick up my grandma and my aunt at my house and then i go to church so that's what i'm gonna be doing this morning yeah and i will see y'all at church mind you i don't know how, my, how much i'm gonna vlog but i'll try to vlog just a little bit for y'all so currently on the way to my home um i live about 45 minutes away 
but on Sunday mornings it's less than that so I can get there in about 40 is what the GPS said I really wish I could have y'all hear my playlist but since I record on my phone obviously that's not gonna happen but like I love my worship playlist so much I've been like adding stuff to it like beefing it up as I find more and more songs like more and more songs that I really like or songs that I've never necessarily put on a playlist but I know or stuff like that but yeah I feel like I'm, I'm extra excited for church this morning and I don't know why okay y'all sorry this is hard because like I don't have a tripod anymore we're gonna put it right there I just got to church dropped off my grandma and my aunt at the front door I took off my scarf obviously and I'm about to put on my heels and go sorry this is such a bad angle I'm about to put on my heels and go inside and at my church I do run the stream and like the display stuff so I am in like the media room and I have in like headphones kind of thing during service I will show y'all like what my setup is back there and everything turn this down y'all okay church is over i didn't record that much um y'all saw my sisters and y'all saw my setup just a little bit church was like really really good like i really enjoyed service today like it was really good after church on sundays i'll like find something to eat somewhere i am at my pastor's house with some of the other youth from the church and we're just gonna eat dinner here um this doesn't happen every week sometimes it's just like fast food and go back to the dorm it really depends but this week I just happen to get free food so <laughs> love that after this i'm just gonna go back to the dorm and i'm probably just gonna do work for the remainder of the night so i'm gonna eat dinner um and i will see y'all at some point afterwards